Hello guys! Our objectives for this lesson define and describe the union and intersection of sets and use Venn diagram to represent union and intersection of sets. Let us discuss first the intersection of sets. The intersection of sets A and B denoted by A intersection B is the set of all elements which are common to both A and B. Ibig sabihin, masasabi natin na nag-intersect yung sets natin kung meron silang common elements. So, ano yung symbol para kay intersection of sets? Inverted U o yung baliktad na U. Example, set A is equal to 1, 3, 5, 7. And set B is equal to 1, 4, 5, 7, 9. So, titingnan lang natin yung common elements ni A at B. Ano daw sila? 1, 5, 7. Therefore, A intersection B is equal to 1, 5, 7. Another example. Set C is equal to A, C, E, G. And set D is equal to B, D, E, F, G. So, ano yung mga common elements silang dalawa? E and G. Therefore, the intersection C or the intersection of set C and set D is equal to E, G. Next, set F equals 3, 8, 9, 12. And set G equals 2, 5, 10, 15. Hanapin ng common elements. Wala. Therefore, the answer is null set or empty set. Okay? So, ang sagot natin ay empty set or null set. Next, another example. Set R equals 4, 5, 8, 10. And set S equals null set. So, wala na naman tayong intersection. Tama? Kasi yung second set natin ay null set. So, the intersection of set R and set S is equal to null set. So, again, kapag sinabi natin na intersection or intersection of sets, tignan natin yung common elements. Kasi sila yung magiging intersection ng sets natin. Okay? Ano naman ang union of sets? The union of sets A and B denoted by A union B is the set of all elements which belong to A or B or in both A and B. In other words, pag sinabi natin union of sets, combining all the elements of sets. So, pagsasamasamahin lang natin sila. So, anong symbol natin? U. Example, set A is equal to M, N, O. And set B is equal to J, R, S. So, sabi doon natin, ang union of sets, pagsamahin natin yung elements ni set A at set B. So, ano yung elements niya? M, N, O, J, R, S. So, ang sagot natin ay A union B is equal to J, M, N, O, R, S. Another example. Set E is equal to 3, 5, 7, 9. Set F is equal to 3, 4, 5, 7. Observe muna natin yung elements sa set natin. May common? Tama, may common elements tayo. Ano yung common elements natin? K, E, at F. 3, 5, 7. So, kapag may common elements tayo, isusulat lang natin sila as 1. So, E union F is equal to 3, 4, 5, 7, 9. Next, set X equals 3, 8, 10, 11. And set Y is an null set. Kanina, kapag ang y natin ay null set, kukunin natin ang intersection, 
the answer is an set. Pero kapag union of sets, yung elements ang pinag-uusapan natin. Combine. So, ang y natin ay walang element. Ibig sabihin, yung x lang natin ang kukunin natin. So, we have 3, 8, 10, 11. So, the, the x or x union y is equal to 3, 8, 10, 11. Again, kapag sinabi natin union of sets, combining or the combination of all the elements in a given set. Let us have an activity. Set A equals 2, 3, 5, 8. Set B equals 1, 3, 4, 5. Set C equals 0, 2, 4. And set D equals 1, 5, 6, 9. First, kunin doon natin yung intersection ni A at B. So, kapag intersection, ang kukunin natin ay yung, o ang titignan natin ay yung common elements. So, 3 and 5. So, A intersection B is equal to 3, 5. Next, A union B. So, kapag union, combining the elements of the given sets. So, yung element ni set A at set B, pagsasama-samahin natin. So, tingnan natin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8. Again, since may common elements tayo, so, sulat lang natin sila as 1. Again, A union B is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8. Next, A union C. So, union. 0, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8. So, again, A union C is equal to 0, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8. Next, C intersection D. Meron bang intersection? Wala. So, yung common, wala silang common element or elements. Ibig sabihin, walang intersection. So, kapag kaganyan, this is an empty set. Okay? Next, set B or B intersection C. Tingnan natin si B at C. Intersection. Meron bang common element or elements? Meron. That is 4. So, B intersection C is equal to 4. Paano ba natin i-represent si intersection at union of sets? So, gagamitin natin ngayon si Venn diagram. Okay, example, set A equals 3, 4, 5, 7 and set B equals 2, 4, 6, 7. Halimbawa, pinakuha sa atin is A union B. So, kapag A union B, combination of all the elements. So, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, meron tayong common elements. So, sulat lang natin siya as 1. So, A union B is equal to 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Represent natin siya sa Venn diagram. So, yung unang bilog, yun yung set A natin. Yung pangalawang bilog, yun yung set B. Kung titignan natin, dun sa sets natin, meron tayong common elements. So, yun yung intersection, di ba? So, nandun siya sa gitna noong intersection ni A at B. So, yung 4 at 7. So, kahit universal o union, ang pinapakuha sa atin dito, meron pa rin siyang intersection kapag nirepresent natin siya sa Venn diagram. So, bukod sa 4 at 7, ano pa yung elements ni A na nawawala? 3 at 5. How about si B? 2 at 6. So, kapag ka nag-overlap yung Venn diagram natin, this is what we call a joint sets. Another example. Set A equals 1, 3, 5, 7. And set B equals 2, 4, 6, 8. Okay. 
Halimbawa, pinakuha daw si A intersection B. Ano yung common elements natin? Meron ba? Walang common elements. So, therefore, this is an empty set. So, paano natin siya i-represent sa Venn diagram natin? So, yung unang bilog natin ay set A. So, elements ay 1, 3, 5, 7. Tama naman. Next, set B. 2, 4, 6, 8. So, kapag nakita natin, pagkahiwalay yung dalawang bilog, this is what we call disjoint sets. Let's try. Meron tayong three sets. Okay, represented na siya sa Venn diagram natin. So, first, kunin doon natin ng lahat ng elements ni set A. Ano yung elements ni si set A? Tingnan lang natin yung bilog sa A. 1, 2, 3, 9. So, set A is equal to 1, 2, 3, 9. Next, elements of set B. Ano na daw ang elements sa set B natin? Tignan lang natin yung bilog sa B. So, we have 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, the elements of set B are 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Next, elements of set C. Lahat ng elements sa set C natin, we have 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, and 11. So, those are the elements of set C. How about 4? A, union C. Ano da yung A, union C? So, ang titignan lang natin si A at saka si C. Pag sinabi ulit natin na union, combination of the elements. Ano ang daw siya? We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 9, 10, 11. Okay? Next, a intersection B. Saan nag-intersect yung dalawang sets natin? Sa 3, 9. Last, A intersection B intersection C. Saan sila talaga nag-intersect? Itong tatlong sets natin, that is 3.